Plaster of Paris is an inexpensive art material that you can cast, manipulate, and decorate to make all sorts of projects. Plaster is very easy to use. All you need is water, plaster, something to mix it with, and an object to cast. In order to make a mold from a styrofoam plate, you're going to draw your design on using a ballpoint pen or a pencil. Ballpoint pen works best, and make sure that you don't press all the way through the plate. You're going to start your design in the center, and then continue it all the way around. Once you're finished, you'll have your mold ready, and then you'll mix your plaster. Mixing plaster is very easy. For your measurements, be sure to follow the directions on the box, and have your water and your plaster ready, and something to mix it with. It's easiest if you pour the water into the plaster very slowly and mix as you pour. You're going to continue mixing until your plaster is the consistency of pancake batter. Once the plaster is the right consistency, we'll be ready to pour. Have your mold ready and slowly pour the plaster into the top. You may want to use the craft stick to smooth out the top so that it's even. When you're finished, plaster takes about a half an hour to an hour to set, but to fully dry, we recommend letting it sit overnight. Here we have an example of a finished cast. When it's completely dry, you can decorate it using acrylic paint and acrylic jewels. To finish it off, we added a coat of clear gloss. Like I said before, you can do all sorts of things with plaster. You can take other shapes of plates, like this rectangle here, and you can do a classroom project with an Egyptian theme. You can also take very young children and do a more tactile project here using cardboard, sand, plaster, and paint, and they can have lots of fun with it. For more details about Plaster of Paris and other project ideas, please visit our website at www.craftprojectideas.com.